The lake that now covers Pemberton Meadows is being held back by two man-made dikes. The highway is one of the barriers to the water's escapement. The railway is the second barrier. Dynamiting the rail line may be the answer. Uh, if the BC Rail had a bridge down here at the corner of the track years ago, uh, which would handle this whole flow, they took the bridge out and put culverts in. They were totally inadequate. Okay, so there's dam number one. That's what's flooding my house and everybody up uh, around the high school area. They're all being flooded because of that dam there. If that bridge was left in and another bridge under the highway down here to let it through, then this water would all drain off. Right now the river has dropped about two feet and yet the water in my house is still up to the floor. It hasn't moved. Some homeowners want to take matters into their own hands to save their homes after failing to get the attention of those in authority. Even uh, as late as yesterday afternoon, uh, several of us approached the people in charge and told them to, to blow that up or dig it up and to uh, take out the highway and uh, get it moving, uh, but they bungled that one.